Thank you. I'm so thrilled. It's like third time lucky for me in this event. So, uh, yeah, silver first of all in Berlin and then bronze in London and now to finally win the gold. It's kind of what I've been aiming for and finally done it. <laughs> The record was a complete shock, I have to admit. I was hoping for a good time and I knew I was in good shape, but to do that in the heat, I guess I must have been completely relaxed and just going through the motions, not like expecting anything, just wanting to make it through to the semi. So to get that time was just incredible. And then last night, I think I put a little bit too much pressure on myself. Um, I wanted to replicate that time or maybe go under it. And I think I maybe thought that people might expect me to do that, but ultimately I just needed to make it through to the final and to go a 27-2 again tonight. I know it was two one hundredths slower, but I think it's equal to the previous European record, so I'm so happy. Um, my results at the Commonwealth weren't actually as good as I was hoping for, but the overall experience out on the Gold Coast was incredible. I love representing Wales and to win a bronze medal in my individual and in the relay was just, it was incredible. Um, but then to come here and to sort of improve on my performance. I've still got the 100 to go, so that's tomorrow, and I'm hoping that'll be good too. Well, the relay won't be decided until, because there's three backstrokers here, so that'll all be dependent on, yeah, because there's, um, there's Kathleen and Cassie, so uh, depending on who's fastest out of us, we'll then go into the relay, or maybe there'll be a mixture, we, we're not sure at the moment. Um, but I couldn't have asked for a better start to this meet, and I have enjoyed 2018 so far. <laughs>